This is my birthday dessert. Uh, okay. So it's got a layer of lady fingers. Mm -hmm. This is based on the Friends episode, you know. Yeah. And uh, Rachel didn't mention, but I soaked mine in brandy mm -hmm. to soften them up. And then there's a layer of raspberry jam, and then it's a layer of custard, and then raspberries, and then more layer lady fingers, and then beef stewed with peas and onions. She sauteed it. I stewed it. <laughs> Aww. Custard. Yeah. The <laughs> raspberry. I figured it would make it softer plus like mm -hmm. stewed meat, um, so that it would have a more sustainable layer and hold the stuff up and not sink down into the rest of it, although you can definitely see like rivulets of gravy coming down. Um, and then there's a layer of custard and then banana slices and then whipped cream, which I think is melting from the radiant heat of the beef. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we were at the store getting this the other day and you're just like, what the fuck? <laughs> and I'm like, just, if you, <laughs> if you want to laugh, just picture that sometime off camera, Rachel was making this exact same grocery store trip. <laughs> so I might pick out like some of the peas, cause ew. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. It is. Yeah, that, if, yeah if you're gonna make this at home, I suggest waiting on the whipped cream until the very end, cause it's melting. Oh, and I'll also probably skip the beef layer. <laughs> <laughs> some guy watching this is, nope, nope. Authentic. <laughs> what is missing is a layer of bacon. <laughs> <laughs> this is America. Yes. I think you probably hold it up better. I don't even know how you're supposed to serve a trifle. In the trash. <laughs> <laughs> There's like air bubbles. Dude, that's just rude. She's right there. <laughs> right here. Okay, I'm gonna kind of scoop it out. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 now it's all messed up. <laughs> I, think it's, I think you need some more of the bottom layers in there. Yeah. It might be scoop time. There it is. <laughs> Shit. It does look like it did in the show. <laughs> Well, that's okay. It was mostly whipped cream when they were eating it. <laughs> there you go. Oh, Thank you. Uh, Alright. Let's see. Let's get a little bit of everything in here if I can. <laughs> it's trifle time. Happy birthday. It's not that bad. <clears throat> Jam, good. Yeah. Mustard, good. Beef, Ooh. I'm kind of on Joey's side, honestly. <laughs> Yay, it's edible! It's really good meat. The bananas, it's fruit, everything. It's kind of like you're eating this meal on, uh... Mm. <laughs> oh, since Dave just tried to change his mind, he's gonna try it? Mm. Oh. Nope, he's running away because it's gonna make him barf. <laughs> well, there's the brandy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm helping! <laughs> wow! No kidding. Chloe is uh, very interested in what you've already had my first shot of that. Oh, kitties. No, you don't want this. I, I think you're wrong. You don't want that. No. <laughs> I think you're very wrong. <laughs> Too much brandy for you guys. Oh, mm. Mm -mm. It's kind of like you're just eating a meal on a plane. And there was some heavy turbulence. <laughs> and it all just kind of mixed in together. I don't know. I like it. The strongest part is the brain. <laughs> no one I'm flying, I'm usually drinking. So. <laughs> You're gonna be drunk by the time mm -hmm. you finish that. Yeah. The best part is there's enough shit in here to like cover up the taste of the peas. Because rewatching that episode, she said, Can I borrow your rum? and then left the room. But it was oh. way after the lady fingers were fingers were already into the dessert. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what they intended you to soak. I don't know if maybe the jam was supposed to soak into the bottom layer of lady fingers and then the meat juice is supposed to soak into the top layer of lady fingers. I think they probably just used the leaving. I genuinely think it's not that bad. <laughs> like, I'm not just saying that just because Joey liked it and that would be funny. If I, if I didn't like it, I wouldn't keep eating it. <laughs> You're actually going at it with a fair amount of gusto here. There's a lot on here. <laughs> I gotta get something on my stomach before I drink some more. Yeah, get some brandy down there mm. before you drink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. mm. Mm. Was it trifle before beer? You're in the yeah. corner. What's the old I, saying? You know, I don't know that in this case there is one. <laughs> but you can start one. I suggest making this for your own friends. So maybe it's like, is it like chipped beef? How is the, my, my main concern was the custard in co combination with the beef. It tastes like, I don't have that problem that a lot of, that well, you were talking about this, where you don't like it when your food's touched. No. I don't really have that problem. Like, you swirl not, it all together. Not that I do that. Not that I'm like, <laughs> all right, let's just mix the potatoes in with the chicken fingers and like, if I want that, I'll just get one of the, uh, bowls. Um, yeah, one of the famous bowls. 
I'm like, well, it just tastes like meat with some whipped cream on it. <laughs> it's not something I'd make myself, but like, it's like, okay, like I, it, you have like your meat and you still have a little bit of meat aftertaste in your mouth and then you have some dessert. That's about what it tastes like. Oh, it's just like when you get whipped cream on your meat, you know, no big deal. Okay, so that'd be You're not even eating around the peas in your planet. Know, get, get yourself a, a mm -hmm. bowl of chili and just ask them to hit it with some whipped cream. Yeah. You guys go ahead and throw some ice cream on when there. When you're having your burger and you also have a milkshake with you. You know, the trouble you had, I think I'm going to give this one a shot. Go for it. And see if I can cause a little less. It's like, it's like the first slice of pie. It's always the hardest. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because you got to maintain the consistency. <laughs> <laughs> got to make sure you get down to I the know, jam I layer. I figured one scoop to get some top Holy layers. one layer of jam? <laughs> and then another scoop to, oh, wow, that, the smell on that gets a lot more powerful to <laughs> get closer to it. <laughs> that's, see, that's the problem I had with the J.R. Ewing beer the other day. <laughs> it's like, oh, that doesn't, that doesn't look too bad. Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I'm used to drinking rusty old beer. This is fine. If I've ever put <laughs> some... Fruit custard beef, and I think there's a pea in there somewhere. Well, and a raspberry. Make, let's yeah. just make sure. Okay. Oh, you got you got plenty. Everybody. You don't even eat around the peas. I was surprised. <laughs> yeah? You know what? <laughs> You're right. Is it right? <laughs> Dude, that's actually pretty good. Yeah. Joey Holy was shit. right. The rest of them are just snobs. <laughs> yeah. I just, if someone left this out on the balcony, I'd be like Joey and just go have the rest of it. <laughs> the custard and the beef actually go well together. Yeah. It does not taste like feet. <laughs> no. <laughs> I highly disagree with Ross. I'll tell you what, it's not actually custard as much as it is instant vanilla pudding, because custard involves like egg yolks and a double broiler. Oh, so well, maybe, that makes perfect sense. Maybe so that that's that's instant pudding <laughs> yeah. on my beef all the time. That's the difference, Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> Raspberry beef. That is a success. Here's some jam way bigger. <laughs> uh eh. It's not terrible. See? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I, I don't think I would ask for this to be created <laughs> next time. But were someone to screw up and make that, I wouldn't go hungry. <laughs> yeah. There are worse things in the world. I think it, I keep harping on this, but I think it really helps that I use stewed meat because it kind of keeps the meat mouthful kind of separate in mm. your mouth until you get to it. Mm -hmm. My God. So we've got the ladle so you can make sure you get down to the jam and brandy layer. <laughs> Soaked in brandy. That's a fucking phrase. Get down to the jam and brandy. <laughs> Remember when the days of your mom would drop you at the movie theater with a big jar of jam? <laughs> Boy, do I. Like, every part of this says no to my body. Oh, but afterwards it'll say yes. No, it'll probably say nope, 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 nope. <laughs> well, I guess to be fair, we haven't found out what the uh, lasting effects are yeah. yet. Well, there's some beef. <laughs> I think. Well, that's some, jam, my friend. Some, the beef is the brown part. Some homemade preserves. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know there's bananas in this. There's bananas in this. Why is there no discernible like structure to this? Like I put it on here, and it just. <laughs> <laughs> that way it looks just like it does on the show. It really does. Like, this is the sort of thing, like, if I came home and I saw this on one of our plates, I would get really, really mad at the girls, like, God damn it, I asked you to clean up. <laughs> Come home, and this is what I find. Well, we just mixed together everything that was in the fridge. <laughs> God, this is the edible version of doing that, like, it's like some Coke, some milk, <laughs> some some old tea. <laughs> There you, there you go. Oh, yeah, because I was about to ask <laughs> where, beef? where is it? Where to beef at? Oh my God! There's too much to put on one spoonful. <laughs> it's almost like it doesn't. Look at that! Missing hot sauce. Uh. <laughs> I just got to the pee. <laughs> oh yeah, we did pee in it. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's really beefy. <laughs> oh, 
beef and bananas is not a thing that goes together except alphabetically. <laughs> Oh my god, you can fucking grow. <laughs> we liked it. Good for you! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> oh my god, that's so fucking gross. <laughs> what the fuck? Letty. Uh, don't listen to him, it's really good. Yeah, the vote is now uh, one, to, one to three. Yeah. yeah. Uh, one, one against three, four. Uh, it's the opposite <laughs> of the episode. <laughs> it's just one guy who doesn't like it. Oh. I think the trick is maybe to not get a banana in the mouthful, because mine was like beef and a raspberry. See, I think the beef and banana worked really well. Yeah, I, I, I liked it. Little Lloyd liked it. Uh, get you a pee. <laughs> it's oh. only fair. Get a banana in there. I did. Thank you. Oh god. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Oh, it's so fucking gross. It's honestly really not that bad. See? 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 Fuck all of you! <laughs> what the I don't know what it is, but it doesn't taste that See? bad. See? <laughs> <laughs> One to four, you are down. You got voted down, finish it. It's weird. <laughs> that means it's good, Brian. <laughs> that is not how this works. <laughs> that's awesome. This is yeah, right? What the fuck? Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> that's delicious. <laughs> Don't do that. Is this a whole but it's not that bad. Yeah. yeah. I'm Dave's had enough of this bullshit. He's leaving. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that I order it in a restaurant, but <laughs> it's, it's really not bad. The bananas and beef actually complement yeah. each other surprisingly well. Wow. Sure. No, it's not. We're <laughs> up <laughs> to like five to one. To be fair, that's Brian's least favorite episode. <laughs> 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 yeah, that was the problem. I <laughs> it's all about context. <laughs> now, if it was the one where they go to the hospital from ER and then get some dates with the uh, <laughs> with uh, Noah Wiley, <laughs> George Clooney, <laughs> then I'd be fine. That's fun, right. Early nineties George Clooney, Clooney and Noah Wiley. <laughs> The I wacky from, from like, Dust Till Dawn, George Clooney. I <laughs> Roseanne, George Clooney. <laughs> Not Facts of Life, Clooney. Well, you know, he needed to educate. He needed please, to grow a little. Please, Return of the Killer Tomatoes, George. Oh, oh yeah, fuck yeah. yeah. 